what does that say about him, uh, how he handles things? Well, the he, he never even complained in the locker room. And, uh, you know, that's being in a tough situation uh, is a really professional thing to do. And, uh, you know, everybody knows that he wanted to play. And uh, it was obvious, you know, a guy was uh, working out any time he get a chance. And, uh, you know, it's, we, we're going to miss him definitely. You know, he's a great teammate, uh, always helped everybody, you know, veteran with his experience. But, you know, we, we only wish him the best. What about the game with, uh, tonight, OKC? Obviously, the last time that was the uh, last time here, uh, the double overtime game, Marcus 56. So what, uh, they're coming in, they're kind of wounded a little bit. They've lost, what, three in a row and four of the last five or something like that? Uh, I haven't checked how many they lost before, but uh, yeah, they're, they're a dangerous team no matter what. And aggressive, fast breaks, and you, you, can't, you can't just lose focus at any moment because they're going to get some steals, easy, fast breaks. And uh, even if you have a lead, it, it can be erased real quickly. So, so we got to be focused, play defense, get back in transition, and all the offense is going to come. They lead the league in deflections and getting the loose balls. So ball security is very important. Isn't Definitely. It? we got to be strong with the ball. we got to play physical at the same time. We can't be afraid of uh, you know, getting to the basket and, uh, you know, we can't be afraid of the turnovers, but you have to limit them as much as possible. Pop said the other night that that kind of defense we all played the other night. He said, if we play defense like this, we could win. So that's the kind of team we've got. We've got to Definitely. I think we, we proved that in uh, December, beginning of January, that playing defense like that is going to put us in a position to win every night. And, uh, you know, the offense is going to be sometimes ups and downs. But if the defense is there, we, we, we definitely put ourselves in a position to win. What's your first reaction to your brother being signed? Uh, I, I was really happy, you know, he, he deserves it. And uh, as much as he's worked uh, all, all over his career, you know, he's, he, he wasn't so lucky with the, with the height that I got from in my family. But, uh, you know, the way he worked uh, and, you know, he was a professional guy always. And, uh, and that's why it was actually so easy for him to get out of this contract in, in Italy because the team was uh, really happy with uh, how he performed and uh, what kind of a person he is. So, you know, he definitely deserves it. Bertans taking over. <laughs> well, hopefully, yeah. You know, I hope he can uh, he can prove himself here uh, at, at the end of the season now, and uh, you know, just stay here and uh, become a constant NBA player. And you know, that that would be great. Growing up, you guys were you guys competed pretty hard. I remember you told me. Uh, oh yeah, I couldn't take a loss. <laughs> uh, and he was exactly the same. If he lost to me, it was even worse probably. But. Uh, uh, we, we competed always and uh, hated to lose, so I guess that's why we don't play one-on-one -on -one that much anymore because both of us can't take that loss. So, so we try to be more friendly, uh, I guess, in that point.